First Alert Weather Update is brought to you by Custom Engineering Heating and Cooling. Good Monday evening, Mid-Michigan. Chief Meteorologist Chris Eastlick with your Monday forecast update. Temperatures are expected to be in the 40s as we head through tonight, staying a little bit more mild than a lot of the nights that we've had recently, and we'll also see temps jump into the 50s tomorrow afternoon. That will follow a morning round of rain, and if we can see some sunshine after that round of rain moves out, I do think some of these could eventually turn into 60s. Speaking of rain, we do have a few areas of showers showing up on radar early tonight. We don't expect these to reach the ground. The atmosphere down where we are is relatively dry. However, you can clearly see plenty of showers off to our west, including some snow, but that snow should stay to our north this time around. We're more concerned with the showers that will be developing off to our west. As far as the severe weather outlook goes for tomorrow, it's a marginal risk for now. We'll see if that ends up changing as we head through tomorrow. The big question is we have plenty of wind shear that normally leads to the development of severe thunderstorms. It's just the fact that we may not have enough fuel to take advantage of that wind shear. That's something that we'll be watching closely for tomorrow. I think we'll get storms regardless. It's more or less the intensity of those storms as they come through. 1 to 9 p.m. seems to be the uh, time frame we're concerned about. If we do see severe storms, we think main uh, the main threat there is going to be wind. However, we can't completely rule out a brief spin up as that line of storms moves through. I'll show you what you mean or what I mean in a second. As we go through tonight, everything is dry through midnight and even the few hours after that we expect to stay dry, but it's closer to the morning commute tomorrow that we start to see that rain move back in this morning round not expected to be severe. Some heavier rain showers, but overall that moves through without much problem at all. Here's late morning and early afternoon. Things really start to quiet down for a time. We'll be breezy and that southerly wind should warm us up quite a bit. We may even break into some sunshine here and there, but that will allow the atmosphere to recover a bit. We've got storms redeveloping as that happens. Those will move off to the east as we go through the night. These in a linear structure like this tend to suggest straight line winds most of the time. However, we can get occasionally these little kinks along the line that could lead to again a brief spin up. We're not expecting this to be the threat that it was our previous event, but still it's something we don't feel completely comfortable ruling out entirely. As we work through the rest of the night, storms eventually end by 9 or 10 o'clock and then the rest of the week after that looks pretty good. It will be windy regardless tomorrow, even in the absence of storms, so secure any loose objects that you might have around the house before leaving tomorrow, expecting gusts be, to be between 30 and 40 miles per hour. Your seven day forecast shows dry days Wednesday, Thursday and Friday, a small chance for a few showers on Saturday. Easter Sunday looks pretty good. We'll have upper 40s and some sun between the clouds. Stay with WNEM TV5 on air, on the go and online for more news and weather updates.